Hey, what's going on YouTube? Um, want to come to you do this video? Um, Bow Wow did this interview, this radio interview in the van at HitWorldStarHipHop.com. Um, in this video, <laughs> I had to talk about it because there's a couple things that go on in this video. First of all, he was talking about he lost his virginity at 16, and he said he lost it to somebody named El Esther Baxter. First, he didn't want to say, he just said the issues, the initials, excuse me, EB, and then finally, I guess, Heather B, and I think Sway finally got on there with Esther Baxter. And, um, First off, I thought he said Esther Braxton. So that was my first thing. I was like, oh my God, it's a, it's a missing Braxton sister we don't know about. Then she slept with Bow Wow and I, I, I'm lost because that ain't Braxton family values. Then I, then I thought he had said Esther Dean. I'm like, oh my God, really Bow Wow, Esther Dean? I mean, she's a cool chick, but really, you, Esther Dean? Wow. And then they said Esther Baxter, which everybody was like, oh, my boys was like, oh yeah, that's, what, that's one of the bad video chicks. I'm like, I don't probably seen her before. I probably don't know her name, you know, because I can't afford a video chick, you know, you got to have some real money because, you know, they some, woo they want some money, money. But still, so he said he lost it apparently to Esther Baxter and he couldn't control himself or something. I don't even know. He a little bow wow. A little bow wow. You just don't know. Whatever. So then after that, he was answering some question. And one of the questions that tripped me out, he said, so I think Sway asked him, what's the longest he's ever been without a shower? And I think he said three days. And because he was on the road. And I'm like, dude, three days without a shower? And he was, and basically said, because the bathrooms were not looking, you know, were messed up or, or, or nasty. Now, I don't know about you, but as much as money as you got, Bow Wow, bro, I know it had to be some kind of tour bus. Bro, get, go get you a bottle of aquafit of water. Go up in there and do a man wash something. You know, wash your areas all up and down. And you know what I'm saying? Because I don't, don't nobody want no dirty balls. You know, you a superstar too. You had all that money. Bro, you couldn't, you know, don't walk around with dirty balls. That's wrong, you know? And, and there were a lot of other things. I know nothing he said in the video. They were talking about people he, he, he wouldn't smash. And he was talking about Demi Moore. He wouldn't smash her. She's too skinny. Okay, maybe, she, maybe she's a little too skinny. Maybe she ain't got no butt. But she got moolah, baby. And Bob, you, you need to be back on your hustle again. You're talking about Lil' Kim. Okay, I can understand about Lil' Kim because she ain't the way she used to be. And she people don't really recognize her. But it is what it is. But Bow Wow, congratulations on your job at 106 and Park. Um, keep doing your thing. Hopefully you'll have an album come out sometime within the next four, three, five, eight, nine, ten, somewhat odd number of years. But why? You need to go back up with Jermaine Dupree. That's when you're making hits. That's when you need to go back to. I understand you with Young Money, NYC, or whatever, NYB, or ALB, or ABC, or whatever. But that's when you're freaking making hits. So do your thing. Um, congratulations on your daughter. You know, that's that's a wonderful feeling and I know you're happy being a father. But yeah, do your thing. And um by the way, I don't walk around dirty bombs, okay? You're my